All right, so we have that triple threat. The Intercontinental title on the line. Oh, wow. Finn Balor's like, yeah, you know what? Screw it. Sling Blade, right off the bat. <laughs> oh, no, he's not going to pit. He's not going to try to pit him. Is there. on a roll right off the bat all Finn Balor all uh, all the time right now like Miz and Seth have not had much in the terms of uh, offense right off the bat have they so this match this match being set up it's been an interesting one it's been a very very interesting one indeed um so they set this up through, uh, you know, Miz was wanting to know who would be facing it for the Intercontinental title. And then Kurt Angle was like, it could be your opponent tonight. So it ended up being Seth Rollins. So Seth Rollins and Miz had a pretty long match. And then, uh, and Seth Rollins won. But then immediately afterwards, Finn Balor comes out and then they have another match, which Finn wins as well. So both were given Intercontinental title opportunities out of it even though Finn technically did beat a guy who had just been through a pretty long match uh, to go along with it it's a little weird but it's, that's fun but uh, the setup has been like Miz trying to one up everyone but failing in most cases even to the point that he uh, teased the breakup of the Miz Taraj with him and Bo Dallas and Curtis Axel uh, but it ended out being that the club came out and helped out Finn and Seth and uh, and got rid of them after the ruse was you know thrown out there that they weren't breaking up breaking them up the mistrage which was a great segment like the same as we've had so far oh springboard Phoenix splash Wow um so which we've had some really good segments. Even down to the point that they've been kind of using this real life thing with the Miz, um, with the Miz having uh, his baby being born over this last week, and kind of playing it off on Raw, like he had, he it's like he no sold the whole aspect of the match going on in the ring with uh, Finn Balor and Seth Rollins, which was a great match going on. And they just had Miz continually just talking about uh, his baby. And they had the commentary play off of that as well a little bit. And he... Well, are we going for the coup de grace already? Yes! Coup de grace! Two. Three! And <laughs> Finn Balor. Wow, that was quick. Finn Balor picking up the win super quick in the triple threat and winning the Intercontinental title. But yeah, the stuff that they did Monday was great because they made it play off like Miz is no selling the fact that these two guys are having a great match. Super heelish. Though him glowing over the fact that he had uh, that his wife just gave birth to their baby girl to go along with it. It's, it's some good stuff. I, I, I really have been enjoying the feud. Um, I expect that this match will last longer than just a couple of minutes on the actual pay-per-view itself. But here, Finn Balor goes over in rather quick and convincing fashion um, over The Miz and picking up the Intercontinental title. Well, The Miz and Seth Rollins and picking up the Intercontinental title to go along with it.